and Brent Saragrant, our ctnow.com web producer, is here with me now. And we're looking at all things web, and it's just a big old party, isn't yes, it? Yes, we're talking some fun <laughs> stuff today. Um, you know, having lived in Connecticut my whole life, you might hear people say, there's nothing fun to do. There's a great story from oh, the Hartford not. Current. There's plenty to do. Exactly. The Hartford Current Features Department did a great story on dance clubs in Connecticut. They highlighted Room 960 in Hartford, La Casona in Hartford, and Shrine up at MGM Grand. Right. Um, so it's a great story to read through and prove, you know, there is a lot of fun stuff to do in Connecticut. And we have a related story here that you can click on, Dance Clubs in Connecticut. Okay. It gives you a whole list. It'll break down everything. So if you're maybe not in the area of the ones that they highlighted, we have a great list for you. Yeah, the I was palace. taking a look at this. I mean, I mean, and there's ones all over the state and exactly. all different types of yep. music. I mean, country, if you want uh, more hip-hop dancers, everything going right. on. So, so if you're maybe even looking for something to do this weekend, it's a fun story to click through. You can find it on our homepage. We have it featured really well for everybody. Cool. Well, the at. party may be over for some people. Huh? <laughs> exactly, because we are talking back to school. We have a whole back to school page for everybody. Some schools are going back tomorrow if you have maybe right. a week to plan. That's what Brent just said. Budget-friendly stuff. You know, who should get vaccinated? We, we have a one-stop shop, we like to call it, for back to school for everybody. Even a, a cute little back to school jitters. Yes. Oh. <laughs> All right. Scary stuff. Yeah, well, Sarah, thank you so much but it certainly feels like back to school outside, doesn't it, Rachel? It does.